So let's take a look at both of these robotic arms. I have the Dubot Magician, which is this one. And I have the UARM Swift Pro. These are the most known, best design uh, STEM program robotic arms. They really are. They are the top of the line. When we're talking about a consumer level, educational level robotic arm at a cost that's reasonable. Keep in mind, some of these robotic arms can cost thousands and thousands of dollars, literally. And uh, the price point here is is very good. I would say to the point even excellent. With that being said, there are some differences here. And let's talk about them. So let's take a look at these two uh, robotic arms. As you can see, the U, U arm Swift Pro, the base is small compared to the Dubot Magician. Um, also, the pumping unit is located within the base of the U arm compared to the Dubot Magician, it's located external, which is not a problem. It just takes up a little bit more desk real estate, but not a big deal. Also, you will notice that the frame of the UOM is slim, strong, sturdy. It's built with quality. I mean, it really is. You're getting your money worth here. Um, also, you notice is that they're using a stepper motor rather than a servo motor. Uh, just for the records, though, you um, uh, uh, factory also makes a UOM Swift. And the UOM Swift uses a servo motors rather than stepping motors. I will tell you right now, stepping motors are better, more precise, I should say, than servo motors. So that just put that out there right away. Okay, so this is using a stepping motor and using a gearbox to assist in the precision there. Um, if you look at the Dubot Magician, they're using a stepping motor, much bigger in size. We're going to test out the strength of both of these a little bit later in the next video to see which one's actually stronger. But for now, you can see that the stepping motor of your Dubot Magician is definitely bigger than the U arm. Right? And I will also mention that the Dubot Magician, the frame is strong and sturdy, really good quality, excellent quality. I mean, they both are made to last. These are not toys. These are not something to just give your kids just to play with. All right? They are really a learning tool, really a learning tool. I mean, for the price you're getting, you're getting what you pay for, definitely. Um, with that being said, you notice that the Dubot suction unit have a bigger and stronger uh, servo motor attached. And I will say, I do like the design of the Dubot better than the U-Arm. If you look at the U-Arm, um, they also use a servo motor, but it's much smaller. It's tiny. I don't know why they did that, but it's a smaller motor, nevertheless. Uh, both of the, the U-Arm and the Dubot is spring-loaded, which is good. So if it hits a surface, it won't damage it. Uh, once again, your Dubai Magician also have spring-loaded as well. Uh, a thing, something I didn't like about the way they designed the U-Arm is how they exposed the electronic circuitry for the suction unit. I mean, it's not a really big deal. It's just something you just got to be aware of and be careful. All right. Um, as far as the expandability, which one you could expand more? I will definitely tell you right now that at this point in time, the U-Arm is definitely capable of expanding way more than the Dubot Magician. I mean, you could implement cameras. Right now, as you can see, it have this range finder attached. It was so easy. I just connect it, plug it in the board, and done with it. You could connect uh, a color uh, detector, uh, temperature, humidity. I mean, I could go on and on and on. And it costs, the cost is, is just cheap i mean for example this range finder only costs like three dollars three four dollars plug it in done the software i would say to implement the accessories on you arm is way better than for the dubot magician and we'll talk about the software in another video we also will talk about the strength of which could lift more and in, in another video as well but for now i will definitely tell you that the UARM accessories is just enormously 
I mean, it's, it's a big library. It really is. And the software, which makes it much, I should say not much, but makes it so easy to install and get up and running. It's really, really a big advantage uh, for the u arm is that. With that being said, though, you can expand on the Dubai Magician. I'm not saying you can't. There is a lot of expansions on the arm and in the back of the unit. But... Right now, at this present time, they do have a kit to um, expand with the Dubot Magician. However, that kit is not available yet. Uh, I contact um, Dubot in China, and they sent me to a distributor in America. And um, I'm still waiting for them to get back to me on the course and availability of that unit. So, at the moment, at this time, I'm saying... You can expand on Dubot, but I'm still waiting for more information on that. Okay, so with that being said, uh, the next video will come out. We'll talk about some of the software. We'll talk more about the quality, and we'll talk more about precision. Um, I will give you a little insight, though, about precision, and I will say that the Dubot is definitely a little bit more precise than the U-Arm. And I'm going to show you a side-by-side -side comparison in the next video. Until then, four faces.